<laughs> I must say, I'm here to honor Merv Griffin. <laughs> Merv has been a dear friend of mine and I love his hotel. I think he's a hell of a guy and it's a great treat for me to be here for Merv. I do want to say to those of you that ate the fish, you will die. Clint, I say with due respect, 28 years ago we did Kelly's Heroes and I haven't heard from you since. Clint, I say it, nobody else has said it, and I say it from my heart. You're a lousy actor. Spielberg and all these guys at the table going, oh, we know Clint, I know you. Clint's idea of a good time is sitting on a pickup truck watching his dog bark. <laughs> Mother Eastwood is laughing, knowing damn well you never had so much money in your whole life. <laughs> your son played the bass, we sat through that. Now, probably, your daughter will come up here and do the tango. <laughs> but you know, Clint, and I know, that I have so much on you, which I won't say tonight. Because <laughs> if I spill it out, you're going to be back in Rawhide. <laughs> and now you're in your late 60s. Live up to it. It's over. But Clint, I understand you're engaged now. I don't know if that's official, but whatever the story is, dear, good luck. <laughs> A lot of happiness, dear. <laughs> <laughs> but we had great days together, Clint. Let's have lunch. God bless you, and I love you.